At age 22, Safi Joseph Jr. won the Triple Crown in his native Barbados. Since his arrival in the United States, he has steadily worked his way up through the ranks. Now, he turns his gaze to the Spring Classics and to a worldwide stage. I was born in Barbados and grew up there my whole life to like 12 or 13. And I went to Trinidad after, I went to school there for like three years and then finished off high school in Miami at Gulliver Preparatory. I've basically been in horse racing my whole life. My dad was a trainer, my granddad was an owner. Since I was three years old, I would be around the horses four years old. Like even at five and six, I was riding them. Like the grooms would let me ride them after they trained, which I weren't supposed to do. But you know, when you're young like that, you're fearless and you just want to hang around the horses all day. I became a trainer at 18 in Barbados. And our, our, my first winner in Barbados was a horse named Uncle Jerry. And I was in Barbados till I was 22 and we moved over to America in 2011. I would think the biggest of his has is, is been my dad. My dad's been, he was a trainer in Barbados and very good trainer, not because he's my dad, but very good and he would get horses that lost to form and just be able to get them back into good form and he was good at keeping horses going along. The decision to come to America was because we want to be the best in the world basically and you can't do that in Barbados. Barbados is limited. You only race um, twice a month and over there it's more racing is more of a hobby. I would say we've um, steadily grown and done each better each year but Math Wizard probably last year winning the Pennsylvania Derby put us on, I would say, more of an international or more, more wide known in the USA. Obviously, it was a grade one. It was on M NBC, and it, it was a big upset. So that kind of put us to um, let outside people know us. In Florida, we're, we're pretty established, but outside of Florida, no one, I, I would say a lot of people probably didn't, didn't know us or didn't dare hear about us. So Math Wizard definitely helped. And then since then, the momentum has carried on where people, people, more people are following you now. And the, since all the horses have been in good form and we're just thankful. Obviously we have Chance it. He's a very talented three-year-old now and we've got Tony in shape, another filly. She's three years old and she's, she's on the route to the Oaks. Just to come to the USA is, and, and be able to prove ourselves, that'll, that'll probably be the highlight. You, you realize that you've been dreaming this your whole life and now you're getting to a point where it's actually becoming reality. It's like, just to see it happen is like, wow, dreams do come true.